Gezi, congratulations. It's been some day for yourself. Two of the toughest draws possible, and you've come through them both with flying colours. Congratulations. You must be feeling good right now. Yeah, um, even before the tournament started, I was full of confidence, but sometimes if you get easier draws, then um, next time you come up against a big player, you seem to falter, but, you know, I'm a decent player myself. I don't care who I play. I played two decent players. You know, I got on top of Christoph there early on, obviously 5-0 up, and yeah, happy with the win. 145, 144 finishes. These are performances we're seeing off you now that are up there with the very best that we've seen from Taylor and Van Gogh over the years. Yeah, you know, I, well, on the Pro Tour last weekend, both days I was full of confidence. I was taking checkouts like that, and I was having big averages and winning games, you know, sometimes quite easy. And, and it's not easy to play on the Pro Tour, you know. It's, some very good players there, but you know, I'm in a good run of form. I'm confident as I've ever been. I'm probably playing the best darts I've ever played. So, like I said, at the beginning of the tournament, I was confident anyway, but I'm a lot more confident now. What do you put that run of form down to? Because like you say, last year you were struggled, and all of a sudden, like a flick of a switch and it's just changed. That's, that's darts for you, you know? Well, you can't put your finger on it. Sometimes they go, sometimes they don't, and <laughs> they've started going for me. I've hit a purple patch and, you know, but the scary thing is, I think it's a lot more in the tank. I'm missing doubles here and there. I'm not scoring well in certain legs, and and I'm still having big averages like 104. I think last week I had 109 in the final, 113 here and then. No, I still think there's a lot more in the tank. So I'm still a novice at this game. I'm, I've only been playing four or five years. So give me another four or five years, and I might be all right. Right now, is there a better player on the planet than yourself? Form-wise, probably not. But you know, form. Every day is different, so you can't just rely on form. You just it's, it's good for your confidence, but tomorrow could be a different day. I'm playing pretty well, and hopefully tomorrow the same comes out of my games. You held your composure on that stage as well, because there was something going on behind you that irritated you, where maybe six months ago that had affected your focus. Yeah, you know, I was, it spurred me on a little bit early on. I didn't, I didn't know if Christoph was doing anything, but something was certainly going on on the stage. I'm not blaming him in any way, but something was happening, and... I was getting frustrated, but sometimes when the crowd's on my back and I get frustrated, I play better, so I don't know. Something was happening, but I seemed to shrug it off and cope with it pretty well, so um, yeah, I'm happy. Obviously, Christoph beat you here in the Players' Championship well, as well. Was that important to overturn that defeat? Because it was one yeah, that you probably should have won. I'm 5-0 up, 8-2 up, or 8-1 up. I should have probably gone 9-1 up. I missed two darts. And it's always in the back of your head, but then I was like, 8-2 up, come out, just win my first, win that leg on my throw, and then... It's, it's going to be really tough for him. It was tough for him anyway, but thankfully I got over the line. Gazi, congratulations on a fantastic day, and we wish you all the very best in the finals tomorrow. Cheers, buddy. Thanks. Thank you very much. Thanks.